The owner of a Panama City Beach restaurant believes she's the victim of selective enforcement. She says she's being unfairly targeted for violating noise ordinances. But as News 13's Chloe Sparks tells us, county officials say they were just trying to answer residents' complaints. The Barracuda Beach bar owner Kathy Capuano is relieved to have live music back on the deck of her restaurant. She recently had two noise violations dropped. They did not do the decimal reader, no. Bay County Sheriff's deputies issued the citations. Well, we hired an attorney and he took, he took care of everything for us. So, because what they did wasn't right. So, you know, they were singling us out for no reason at all. Sheriff's officials say they have received at least 24 noise complaints since February 2021 directed at Barracuda's address. Bay County Government Center also received several noise complaints. Some people have claimed they run as a nightclub, which they aren't allowed to do. It has to do with the old Buckwild nightclub that used to be in the building. There were some uh, issues with uh, ownership and um, uh, bars and nightclubs being operated on that property in the past. Uh, the county went to court with them and they settled with a stipulated settlement agreement. The agreement applies to anyone who owns the property. It limits the hours of operation to 2 a.m., stops live performances after 1 a.m., states the owner must utilize the second floor as a restaurant offering a full menu of food while operating. The closest residents to the restaurant bar only have good things to say. My bedroom is literally behind their back wall and we can lay in our room or lay in our living room here and watch TV and we don't even know there's anything going on. So. I particularly don't know if it's like a, as much neighbors as it might be other bar owners in the area that are upset with the co competition is really it seems more like that to me. Just a few doors down, resident Mark Hyde says he goes to bed at nine, so the music can be a bother, but never enough to do something about it. Never felt like it was that problematic. Yeah, I've had neighbors in the past that might have been a little bit more uh, intrusive, you know, but yeah. The owner just wants to operate her business in peace. We are here for the neighbors and the locals are what makes us and we appreciate them so much. In Panama City Beach, Chloe Sparks, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Bay County recently changed its noise ordinance to make it more restrictive. Sheriff's officials met with the state attorney's office today to find out what information they need to include on noise citations now under the new ordinance. Well, Haven, 